morning everyone. I am doing a new soap today. Really pretty fun one. Jammin' Rock Candy. It smells like super sweet sugar, lollipops, um, berries. Totally sweet, yummy candy fragrance. Yum. Cannot wait to do this one. Um, I'm going to do some bright colors with it, like the neon pink and neon blue from Nature's Garden. And a little bit of titanium for the rest of the batch. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, sorry, had to stop filming for a second, but I'm back. So let's add our lye water. And we're going to bring it to emulsification. Very super light, light trace. Okay. Now, I want to separate these out. And I'm not going to add too much fragrance to these guys. Because I don't know how much they're going to change. Okay. So I'm going to spread this between the three parts. There we go. I'm going to add my titanium dioxide to the main batch. And then I'm going to add blue and pink to these. This one's going to be blue. This one's going to be pink. And when you're doing multiple colors like this, start off with your lightest color to mix first, then to your darkest. So we're going to do the white. And this is already starting to thicken up, so I'm going to move kind of quick here. And then over here. put in the bulk of the lighter color. So it's got a bit yellow. And I'm sure it's probably going to go a bit more, but we'll see. Okay. And let's start playing with our colors. I'm going to do blue down one side and pink down the other. I'm going to keep a little bit for the top.
this yellow. Finish that off. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Boy, I like the candy scent of this one, though. Now, I did do a water reduction on my recipe, so that will contribute to the reason it's thickening up a bit faster. But I would suggest that this is a slight accelerating fragrance, so do all your prep beforehand. Have everything ready to go. I mean, it's still workable, as you can see. But you're definitely going to want to plan for it. Okay, so now... I'm going to just do some hard stripes, just like that through it, okay? Over, up, up, there we go. I'm all the way down at the bottom, dragging that through, just so I can get those to cross over a bit, okay? And I'm going to go back through. One more time. Notice I'm only doing this. None of this, just this, okay? So down and up. I'm going in between the lines I had just formed. And that way, I've got them in one direction and the other. There we go. Pull that. Make sure all those gaps are filled. Okay, now I'm going to finish off the top with the last of our blue. Now see, it's thickened up, so stir it up. If it gets too thick on you, just stir it. You can loosen it back up again, and it'll start to heat up a little bit. But that's okay. That's how you can get a control on it. All right. Let's see, so I had blue on that side and pink on that side. So now I'm going to switch it because I can see the pink there and a little bit of blue there. So now I'm going to put the blue where the pink was. Now, I'm not done playing with this. I'm going to come back to it with my spoon and do stuff with it. But for now, I just want to get that soap on there and in place before it gets too thick. And then I'll play with it. Looks like I had a little bit more blue than I did pink. 
That's all right. That's what makes it look handmade, right? It's not perfect. Smush all that in there, and then we can start to really play with it. I think I'm gonna get a little spin. All right, here we go. It's all finished up and ready to be cut. That's what it ends up looking like. Ready? Here we go. our end cut. There we go. Well, I was hoping for a bit more swirl in there, but it thickened up pretty fast on me. I'm still happy with it. The colors are awful pretty. And the scent is really nice and strong. So it stayed pretty true to what was in there. There we go. Love it. Very pretty. Awesome possum. And I am adding some beautiful oak moss from Donna's own trees just right along 